Other videos have discussed the basic concept of tableau maps, latitude and longitude acting as XY coordinates for marks, and a background map downloaded from the internet appearing behind the marks. Well, Tableau lets you take that concept a step further with custom background images and your own custom-defined XY coordinate system. The first concept to grasp is the relationship between your background image and the measures that you'll place on rows and columns to plot marks on top of the image. You'll need to determine the number of units that make up the width and height of the image and identify or create X and Y coordinates that will plot properly on the image. For example, you may choose to use the pixel resolution of your image to create your XY coordinate system. But you can really use any numbers you want, as long as the relationship between the image size and XY measures is correct. In this case, we'll use pixels. The body image is 99 pixels wide and 325 pixels high. As with maps, you need to identify the two specific measures that will activate the background image. Like latitude and longitude, which automatically display a map, these two measures will display the custom background image once you place them on rows and column shelves. These measures can contain any XY coordinate system that fits the background image they'll be placed on. In this case, they're simply calculated fields that return various values based on the part of the body they will plot on top of. When you're ready, choose Map Background Images from the drop-down menus. Choose the data source that contains the custom XY coordinates. Click Add Image. Give the image a meaningful name. Then, either type in the file name or URL that references the image, or click the Browse button to search for it. Now, choose the specific measures that will define the X and Y coordinates to plot on top of the image. And finally, specify the extreme lower and upper left and right values that the X and Y measures may have. This creates the relationship between mark placement and the size of the image. In this case, the extreme left of the image is at position 0 and the extreme right is at position 99. And the extreme top is position 0 with the extreme bottom being 325. Now, drag the X measure to columns and the Y measure to rows. Notice that Tableau will aggregate the measures as it usually does for traditional charts. This probably won't show a background image, as the sum of the X and Y coordinates will be way beyond the coordinate system of the image. You may choose to disaggregate data from the analysis menu if you want to plot individual data rows on the chart, or maybe just change the measure aggregation to average. Now, create individual marks on the image by dragging a dimension to the appropriate place on the marks card, such as Label. And drag any additional measures you wish to analyze, to size or color. You may wish to adjust the color palette. Change chart zoom level. Hide the row and column headers. And format the chart to set zero lines to none. Tableau's custom background image feature brings you a whole new world of custom visual analysis possibilities.